Ronald G. Ron Hayes was an American television actor who, as an activist in the environmental movement, worked for the establishment of the first Earth Day, observed on April 22, 1970. He was a member of the Sierra Club and a founder of the ecological interest group Wilderness World. In his acting career, Hayes appeared primarily on westerns, but he also had starring or recurring roles in several series, including The Everglades, The Rounders, and Lassie. Biography Hayes was born to Sam Hayes and the former Marion de Rode Brune in San Francisco. Both parents were heavily involved in the theatre and acting. Hayes graduated in 1952 from nearby Stanford University with a degree in foreign relations. Hayes was a United States Marine in the Korean War. After military service, Hayes worked for radio station KSJO in San Jose, California. In 1957, Hayes moved with his wife, Joan, and their three children, Vanessa, Peter, and Heidi, to Hollywood to launch an acting career. He was soon cast in his first engagement in 1957 as Jeff Miller in the episode A Case of Sudden Death of the NBC legal drama On Trial, or The Joseph Cotton Show starring Joseph Cotton. He was further cast as Lieutenant Harry Summers in the episode Family Portrait of Lee Marvin's NBC police drama M Squad. Late in 1957, Hayes was cast as the Durango Kid in the episode Town of Fear of the ABC Warner Brothers Western series Cheyenne, starring Clint Walker in the title role. Walter Coy played Sheriff Sam Townley in this episode, in whose jail the kid was being held prior to his ill-fated escape. John Doucette was cast as Bill Jenkins, the leader of a lynch mob that plans to remove the kid from jail and to hang him. Hayes appeared again with Walter Coy, along with Paul Birch and Robert Knapp, in the 1959 film Gunman from Laredo. The story of a man seeking revenge for the murder of his wife and the unlikely path to closure for his grief. 1960s In the 1961-62 season, Hayes appeared in all 38 episodes as Lincoln Vale, officer of Florida's Everglades County Patrol, in the half-hour syndicated adventure series The Everglades. After The Everglades, Hayes appeared in more westerns, including the last season of NBC's Laramie in two episodes, Shadow of the Past and Protective Custody. He then appeared in Jeffrey Hunter's Temple Houston as Lambert in the episode Billy Hart and on The Virginian as Marshall Brett Cole in the episode Siege, both on NBC. From 1960 to 1964, Hayes appeared as different characters in eight episodes of Wagon Train. In 1964, he appeared once on John Gavin's Destrius Jethro Jellico in Blood Brother-in-Law. In 1965, he was cast as Jamie Brewster in the episode A Long Way Home of A Man Called Shenandoah. Ron and Joan Hayes are married ended in a bitterly contested divorce. Early in 1965, he married Betty Endicott, a stunt actress on NBC's Bonanza. Hayes himself appeared six times on Bonanza. From 1966, Hayes co-starred as Ben Jones in MGM's short-lived ABC comedy western series The Rounders about cowpokes on a Texas cattle ranch, with Chill Wills as rancher Jim Edlove and Patrick Wayne, a son of John Wayne, in the role of Howdy Lewis. Other co-stars included Walker Edmiston and Strother Martin. He also appeared on three 1966 episodes of the CBS animal drama Dactara playing Roy Meadows, an escaped murderer. In 1967, Hayes appeared twice as George Moran on Walt Disney's Wonderful World of Color, with Roger Mobley in the title role. He appeared that same year in several episodes of the ABC soap opera General Hospital. In 1968, he appeared in the last episode of the first season of Iron Side. He remained in demand for appearances on television westerns, having guest starred twice in 1968-69 on the High Chaparral in the episodes Threshold of Courage and A Fella Called Kilroy. Hayes appeared in eight segments of James Arness's CBS series Gunsmoke. 
later career from 1969 to 72, after Robert Bray, as Forest Ranger Corey Stewart, had departed the series, Hayes appeared seven times on CBS's Lassie. Six of those in 1971-1972 in the role of rancher Garth Holden. His co-stars at the time were Larry Pennell, as his brother, and Larry Wilcox as a friend of his son's. In 1979, Hayes portrayed a sheriff Pinter in Arness's ABC series How the West Was Won. Otherwise, most of his work in the 1970s was on drama series, including Raymond Burr's Ironside on NBC and The Mod Squad on ABC. He also appeared in three CBS series, Jack Lord's Hawaii Five-0, William Conrad's Cannon, and Buddy Epson's Barnaby Jones. His last recurring work was as Hank Johnson in 1981-1981 in six episodes of CBS's primetime soap opera Dallas. Thereafter, in 1983, he appeared as Tim Coulton in Children of Jamestown of NBC's The A-Team starring George Peppard, Death. Hayes died at the age of 75 of complications of a subdural hematoma as the result of a fall near his residence in Malibu, California. He was survived by his three children and five grandchildren. Western Roles From 1958 to 69, Hayes appeared in at least 21 Western series. Clint Walker Cheyenne as the Durango Kid in Town of Fear and as Coat Martin in Reprieve on ABC. Wade Preston's Colt, 45 as Rick in The Golden Gun, 26 Men, syndicated series about the Arizona Rangers, a force limited to 26 members, with Edgar Buchanan in episode entitled Cross and Double Cross. James Garner's and Jack Kelly's Maverick in the episodes Seed of Deception and Passage to Fort Doom on ABC, Ty Harden's Bronco in Trail to Taos and Red Water North on ABC, Rory Calhoun's The Texan as Rich Tabor in The Ringer as Walt Dawson in 30 Hours to Kill and as Ty Embry in Showdown, Steve McQueen's Wanted. Dead or Alive on CBS, as Paul Bradley in the episode, Reckless. Earl Holloman's Hotel do Puri in the episode, Sundance Goes to Kill on CBS. Rory Calhoun's The Texan in episodes, The Ringer, and Showdown on CBS. Joel McRae's Wichita Town as Scotty in, Sidekicks, on NBC. Henry Fonda's and Alan Case is the deputy as Ralph Jensen in Marked for Bounty on NBC. Overland Trail as Luke in Mission into Mexico on NBC. The syndicated Tombstone Territory as Chuck Cumber in Day of the Amnesty and The Innocent Man. The syndicated Death Valley Days as Dan Bartlett in Devil's Bar. Dale Robertson's Tales of Wells Fargo as Ira Kyle in Run for the River on NBC. Chuck Connors is the Rifleman as Bruce in Six Years and a Day on ABC. Klondike as Harold Enright in Sitka Madonna on NBC. Charles Bateman's syndicated Two Faces West as Tolly in Music Box. Bernanza in the following episodes. Desert Justice, The Rescue, Mirror of a Man, The Bride and Groom, Night of Reckoning, and in Emily. Rawhide as Owen in Incident of the Haunted Hills and as Frank Lorden in Incident of the Four Horsemen on CBS and Bat Masterson on NBC, starring Gene Barry, in which Hayes played his most significant role to date, four appearances as Marshall Wyatt Earp.